With Christmas just about a month away, it's time for us to soak the fruit for our traditional fruit cake. Hi, you're watching Plating It with Wendy, where I share with you recipes which impress with ease. These delicious dried fruits are soaked in alcohol and bring a ton of flavor to our Christmas cake. So let's get chopping. This is the first of a two-part recipe and don't miss next time's video to see it all come together. Let's start with 100 grams of black currants. Next, let's add 100 grams of pitted prunes, which we're going to chop into small pieces. Now to that, let's add 100 grams of dried apricots and we're going to chop them up too into small pieces. And for another delicious flavor, we're going to go in with 100 grams of dried figs, which we're going to chop up into small pieces. To make our cake super moist, we're going to add 150 grams of pitted dates, which are going to dice into smaller pieces. For that lovely warm flavor, let's add 50 grams of candied ginger. And for a fruitcake classic, let's add 300 grams of sultanas. And no Christmas cake is complete without mixed candied peels. And we are adding 200 grams to our cake. To that, let's add quarter cup of orange marmalade, which is going to give our cake that perfect zing. Let's give the fruit a good mix so that they get well distributed. Let's transfer the fruit into a large glass jar. This is perfect to store them while they soak. Now let's booze it up. Now you can go in with a good old fashioned dark rum, but I like to use Contra. Let's pour in about 350 to 400 ml of your preferred alcohol. Now let's cover the jar with an airtight lid. Let's give the bottle a good shake so that the alcohol mixes well with the fruit and we're going to preserve this away from sunlight and at room temperature. Every next day, you want to give the bottle a shake again the same way so that the alcohol gets a chance to get absorbed by all the fruit. Now don't forget to join me next week to make our Christmas cake. And if you're new to my channel or haven't subscribed already, subscribe. And if you hit on that bell icon, you'll be notified every time I upload a new video. And while you're at it, hit that like button and leave me your comments below. Thanks for watching. See you soon.